Hello, my name is uh, Naftali Rubin. I'm an international lawyer. Um, we're going to speak today about livelihood, and uh, we would like uh, now in this uh, period of time, which has been a little bit difficult, we would like to speak and to give you like two advice how to have a good livelihood. The first advice is um, that every one of us, every each of us, can choose his livelihood according to what he likes. Someone who likes a work which is more physical. And uh, so perhaps he'll be, he will be attracted by work in transport, construction. Uh, another one lacks a more um, mind-oriented uh, livelihood, and therefore he could uh, choose high-tech. It's very important to choose the livelihood you want according to your, um, to your good points, to what you like and what, to your strong points. Um, and sometimes it's a good thing to, to wait a little and not to, to run and to take the first uh, profession, but to, to have a little bit of thinking. Uh, this advice is brought in uh, uh, gates of bitachon, gates of trust, of confidence, uh, by Rabbeinu Bechaye. It's a very good advice. It's the first advice. The second advice is that uh, we should know that uh, livelihood is connected to uh, speaking good about each other and uh, not uh, going to uh, La Chonara. When someone is uh, uh, saying good words and complimenting and uh, is positive and looks at another person with uh, a positive eye, he, he should know that this will bring you Bezrat Hashem uh, livelihood. He will make money, he will uh, be successful, be a successful businessman um, just by saying good words and avoiding La Chonara. So let's uh, try to apply this, uh, these two advice. The second advice from Rabbi Shalom Arush in his uh, uh, bestseller, uh, The God of Riches. So wish you a lot of blessings in the Parnassah and the family and in the community. Good luck.